He likes both. He don't know how airport work. Uh, never mind, wrong name. He likes both. He ate Balocopter. You know him, right? Recognize the team. I will show you in guidebook number 10. Drake. The underrated CEO that nobody believes worthy to be part of tier 3. I say that because it's rare I see him in Global League. And I'm very happy because I ain't mirror match. I hope guys will enjoy this new entry. Let's review Drake. So, let's speak about his day to day. He has weak air, air unit. I believe he has a 20% penalty. So, this means his battlecopter, his bomber, his fighter, they are all weak here by a lot. And if you play on Advanced Wars Dual Strike, Drake has a 20% uh, firepower increase on his naval unit for the same drawback of the air unit losing 20%. If you play the first Advanced Wars game, I'm not quite sure, but I believe Drake gains the space uh, with all of his naval units so his naval units uh, can go further they also have I believe a 20 or 25 percent defense increase uh, if you play black hole rising your bolt have a extra space so they move further and they have, I believe, 15% defense increase. If you speak about Advanced Wars by Web, I believe it's 25 defense buff and one extra space with Naval units. So you see, there's like 20 Drake. I feel like he's Spider Man or something. I'm just joking around. So now let's speak about his power and super. His power, 4 stars, uh, remove 1 HP on all enemy units, so the enemy lose 10% of his army, and the full wall is also cut by half. So this means on big map, you will make Copter crash, you will make Black Bolt sink, you will be happy because you kill Battlecopter and your opponent won't have boats. This is Drake Simplified. Boat number two. We got... Uh, no, what am I saying? It's super. It's super is really good. So you see, for seven stars, you global damage your opponent 2 HP, so this is just like Winter Fury, however you cut the full wall by half, and you make it rain, so the enemy has less vision, the ground units will also suffer, because tanks, recon, will lose movement range because of rain, for some reason, don't search why, don't try to understand, it's a video game. Logic is not logic. Now he is tier 3. And I agree with that. Uh, he is really good. He is probably on top of tier 3 with Sanja. Maybe I would place him uh, above Sanja. Just because double damage is broken. But it would be interesting to have a few Sanja versus Drake. With that being said, uh, how to play Drake? Well, focus on your ground unit. Yes, he has better novels, but we all know novels are shit in Advanced Wars. This is really sad. 
Now uh, you can hear some uh, sad Drake noise. This is really sad, I know. Now to counter Drake, we got Andy. Andy counters Drake so hard, but we must say, if you are sad because you are Drake against Andy, it's not lost. Because if you are smart and you do your super and you know you can do a good push during that turn, do it. Even if you will recover with his power or super whatever, you will still do damage. Make sure to kill off any units. So when you know you can have a good push, use your super. You don't care about Andy, you use your super with a push. So you will lose a lot of units. Don't give up already. Now, how to counter Drake. There's Andy, there's Auk. Auk is really a hard counter for Drake. The longer the game will be, the better Auk will be against you. Most of the time, Auk will have his super after you. Now, statistics will tell you, yeah, Drake will get his super more often. But Auk super is just better. Auk day to day is just better. Now, coming to Olaf, this is a very interesting matchup. You are Olaf weakness. Rain affects him the same way snow affects other seal. So if you activate your super against Olaf, Olaf cries. He's like, yo, uh, now I feel how people feel with the blizzard and the and the into play, you see. Now, Drake is good. Co the great is good against a lot of CO. He is good against both of the cast. Drake rolls on any tier 4. Except Sammy, because Sammy should be 3. Drake can also take on tier 2 CO like Eagle, Max, or Olaf. So I think I spoke enough about Drake, there's not much to say about him, I really like to play him, but he's not a complicated seal. So if you are starting Advance Wars, if you're new, you can play Drake, it will be really, very very easy to play, his power is not impressive, it's okay, but his better uh, thing to use is the super. Uh, Mr. Drake has a very fun super. So um, his black bolt are also very strong because of that extra movement. So if you have access to bolts and you have the money, don't hesitate. If you play on naval uh, map, Drake will tend to win, but this is rare, the map needs to be designed this way. And in Double E, we all know it, most of the map are not designed to, uh, to have a lot of novels. The meta is airport and base. So I hope you guys enjoyed that entry, like, comment and subscribe. We will see each other in future video. Have a great day.